The free energy principle tries to explain how biological systems maintain their order non-equilibrium steady state by restricting themselves to a limited number of states. It says that biological systems minimize a free energy functional of their internal states, which entail beliefs about hidden states in their environment. The implicit minimization of variational free energy is formally related to variational Bayesian methods and was originally introduced by Carl Friston as an explanation for embodied perception in neuroscience, where it is also known as active inference. In general terms, the free energy principle is used to describe the principle that any system, as defined by being enclosed in a Markov blanket, tries to minimize the difference between its model of the world and the perception of its senses. This difference can be decried as «surprise» and minimized by constantly updating the world model. As such the principle is based on the Bayesian idea of the brain as an «inference engine». Friston added a second way to minimization, action. By actively changing the world into the expected state, systems can also minimize the free energy of the system. Friston assumes this to be the principle of all biological reaction. Psychiatrist Friston believes his principle applies to mental disorders as well as to artificial intelligence. AI implementations based on the active inference principle have shown advantages over other methods. Topic. Background The notion that self-organizing biological systems, like a cell or brain, can be understood as minimizing variational free energy is based upon Helmholtz's observations on unconscious inference and subsequent treatments in psychology and machine learning. Variational free energy is a function of some outcomes and a probability density over their hidden causes. This variational density is defined in relation to a probabilistic model that generates outcomes from causes. In this setting, free energy provides an upper bound approximation to Bayesian model evidence. Its minimization can therefore be used to explain Bayesian inference and learning. When a system actively samples outcomes to minimize free energy, it implicitly performs active inference and maximizes the evidence for its generative model. However, free energy is also an upper bound on the self-information of outcomes, where the long-term average of surprise is entropy. This means that if a system acts to minimize free energy, it will implicitly place an upper bound on the entropy of the outcomes, or sensory states, it samples. <laughs> Relationship to other theories Active inference is closely related to the good regulator theorem and related accounts of self-organization, such as self-assembly, pattern formation, autopoiesis and practopoiesis. It addresses the themes considered in cybernetics, synergetics and embodied cognition. Because free energy can be expressed as the expected energy of outcomes under the variational density minus its entropy, it is also related to the maximum entropy principle. Finally, because the time average of energy is action, the principle of minimum variational free energy is a principle of least action. Topic: <laughs> Definition. Definition: Continuous formulation. Active inference rests on the tuple omega psi s. A R Q P display style omega psi s a r q p a sample space omega display style omega from which random fluctuations omega element of omega display style omega in omega are drawn hidden or external states psi psi times a times omega a display style psi psi times a times omega to math bound r 
that cause sensory states and depend on action. Sensory states S psi times a times omega a display style s psi times a times omega to math bound r a probabilistic mapping from action and hidden states action a s times r r display style a s times r to math bound r that depends on sensory and internal states internal states R R times S R display style R R times S to math bound R that cause action and depend on sensory states generative den city P S psi M display style P S psi M over sensory and hidden states under a generative model m display style m variational density q psi mu display style q psi mu over hidden states psi element of psi display style psi in psi that is parameterized by internal states mu element of r display style mu in r topic action and perception the objective is to maximize model evidence p s m display style psm or minimize surprise minus log p s m display style log psm this generally involves an intractable marginalization over hidden states so surprise is replaced with an upper variational free energy bound However, this means that internal states must also minimize free energy, because free energy is a function of sensory and internal states. A T equals A R G M I N A F S T mu t display style a t equals underset a operator name a r g min f s t mu t mu t equals a r g m i n mu f s T mu display style mu t equals underset mu operator name a r g min f s t mu f s mu f r e e minus e n e r G Y equals E Q minus log P S psi M E N E R G Y minus H Q Psi Mu E N T R O 
P Y equals minus log P S M S U R P R I S E plus D K L Q Psi Mu P Psi S M D I V E R G E N C E minus log P S M S U R P R I S E Display style underset mathram free energy under brace F S mu equals underset mathram energy under brace E underscore Q log P S psi mid M underset mathram entropy under brace H Q psi mu equals underset mathram surprise under brace log P S M plus underset mathram divergence under brace D underscore mathram K L Q psi mu P psi mid S M G E Q under set mathram surprise under brace log p s m this induces a dual minimization with respect to action and internal states that correspond to action and perception respectively topic <laughs> free energy minimization topic <laughs> Free energy minimization and self-organization Free energy minimization has been proposed as a hallmark of self-organizing systems, when cast as random dynamical systems. This formulation rests on a Markov blanket comprising action and sensory states that separates internal and external states. If internal states and action minimize free energy, then they place an upper bound on the entropy of sensory states. Lim T infinity one T zero T F S T mu T D T F R E E minus A C T I O N Lim T infinity one T zero T Minus log P S T M S U R P R I S E D T equals H P S M display style lim underscore t two inf t frac one t underset mathram free action under brace int underscore zero carrot t f s t mu t d t g e q lim underscore t two inf t frac one t int underscore zero carrot t underset mathram surprise under brace log p s t m d t equals h p s m this is because, under ergodic assumptions, the long-term average of surprise is entropy. This bound resists a natural tendency to disorder, of the sort associated with the second law of thermodynamics and the fluctuation theorem. Topic: 
Topic: <laughs> Free energy minimization and Bayesian inference. All Bayesian inference can be cast in terms of free energy minimization, e.g. When free energy is minimized with respect to internal states, the callback Leibler divergence between the variational and posterior density over hidden states is minimized. This corresponds to approximate Bayesian inference, when the form of the variational density is fixed, and exact Bayesian inference otherwise. Free energy minimization therefore provides a generic description of Bayesian inference and filtering e.g., Kalman filtering. It is also used in Bayesian model selection, where free energy can be usefully decomposed into complexity and accuracy f s mu f r e e minus e n e r g y equals D K L Q Psi Mu P Psi M C O M P L E X I T Y minus E Q log P S Psi M A C C U R A C Y Display style underset mathrm free energy under brace f s mu equals underset mathrm complexity under brace d underscore mathrm k l q psi mu p psi m underset mathrm accuracy under brace e underscore q log p s psi m Models with minimum free energy provide an accurate explanation of data, under complexity costs C, F, Occam's razor and more formal treatments of computational costs. Here, complexity is the divergence between the variational density and prior beliefs about hidden states i.e., the effective degrees of freedom used to explain the data. Free energy minimization and thermodynamics Variational free energy is an information-theoretic functional and is distinct from thermodynamic Helmholtz free energy. However, the complexity term of variational free energy shares the same fixed point as Helmholtz free energy under the assumption the system is thermodynamically closed but not isolated. This is because if sensory perturbations are suspended for a suitably long period of time, complexity is minimized because accuracy can be neglected. At this point, the system is at equilibrium and internal states minimize Helmholtz free energy by the principle of minimum energy. Topic: <laughs> Free energy minimization and information theory. Free energy minimization is equivalent to maximizing the mutual information between sensory states and internal states that parameterize the variational density for a fixed entropy variational density. This relates free energy minimization to the principle of minimum redundancy and related treatments using information theory to describe optimal behavior. Free energy minimization in neuroscience Free energy minimization provides a useful way to formulate normative Bayes optimal models of neuronal inference and learning under uncertainty and therefore subscribes to the Bayesian brain hypothesis. The neuronal processes described by free energy minimization depend on the nature of hidden states. Psi equals X times theta 
times pi display style psi equals x times theta times pi that can comprise time dependent variables time invariant parameters and the precision inverse variance or temperature of random fluctuations minimizing variables parameters and precision corresponds to inference learning and the encoding of uncertainty respectively topic <laughs> perceptual inference and categorization Free energy minimization formalizes the notion of unconscious inference in perception and provides a normative Bayesian theory of neuronal processing. The associated process theory of neuronal dynamics is based on minimizing free energy through gradient descent. This corresponds to generalized Bayesian filtering, where tilde denotes a variable in generalized coordinates of motion and d display style d is a derivative matrix operator mu tilde equals d mu tilde minus mu tilde f s mu tilde Display style dot tilde mu equals d tilde mu partial underscore tilde mu f s tilde mu. Usually, the generative models that define free energy are nonlinear and hierarchical, like cortical hierarchies in the brain. Special cases of generalized filtering include Kalman filtering, which is formally equivalent to predictive coding, a popular metaphor for message passing in the brain. Under hierarchical models, predictive coding involves the recurrent exchange of ascending bottom -up prediction errors and descending top -down predictions that is consistent with the anatomy and physiology of sensory and motor systems. <laughs> Perceptual learning and memory In predictive coding, optimizing model parameters through a gradient ascent on the time integral of free energy free action reduces to associative or Hebbian plasticity and is associated with synaptic plasticity in the brain. <laughs> Perceptual precision, attention and salience Optimizing the precision parameters corresponds to optimizing the gain of prediction errors C, F, Kalman gain. In neuronally plausible implementations of predictive coding, this corresponds to optimizing the excitability of superficial pyramidal cells and has been interpreted in terms of attentional gain. <laughs> Active inference When gradient descent is applied to action, a equals minus a f s mu tilde display style dot a equals partial underscore a f s tilde mu. Motor control can be understood in terms of classical reflex arcs that are engaged by descending corticospinal predictions. This provides a formalism that generalizes the equilibrium point solution, to the degrees of freedom problem, to movement trajectories. <laughs> Active inference and optimal control Active inference is related to optimal control by replacing value or cost to go functions with prior beliefs about state transitions or flow. This exploits the close connection between Bayesian filtering and the solution to the Bellman equation. However, active inference starts with priors over flow F equals gamma V plus times W display style f equals gamma c d o t nabla v plus nabla times w that are specified with scalar v x display style v x and vector 
W X display style W X value functions of state space C F the Helmholtz decomposition here gamma display style gamma is the amplitude of random fluctuations and cost is C X equals F V plus gamma V display style C X equals F C D O T nabla V plus nabla C D O T gamma C D O T V the priors overflow P X tilde M display style P tilde X M induce a prior over states P X M equals exp v x display style p x m equals exp v x that is the solution to the appropriate forward kolmogorov equations in contrast optimal control optimizes the flow given a cost function under the assumption that w equals 0 Display style W equals zero, i.e. the flow is curl-free or has detailed balance. Usually, this entails solving backward Kolmogorov equations. Topic: <laughs> Active inference and optimal decision game theory. Optimal decision problems, usually formulated as partially observable Markov decision processes, are treated within active inference by absorbing utility functions into prior beliefs. In this setting, states that have a high utility, low cost, are states an agent expects to occupy. By equipping the generative model with hidden states that model control policies, control sequences that minimize variational free energy lead to high utility states. Neurobiologically, neuromodulators like dopamine are considered to report the precision of prediction errors by modulating the gain of principal cells encoding prediction error. This is closely related to, but formally distinct from, the role of dopamine in reporting prediction errors per se and related computational accounts. Topic. Active inference and cognitive neuroscience Active inference has been used to address a range of issues in cognitive neuroscience, brain function and neuropsychiatry, including, action observation, mirror neurons, saccades and visual search, eye movements, sleep, illusions, attention, action selection, hysteria and psychosis. Topic. See also Action-specific perception Affordance Autopoesis Bayesian approaches to brain function Decision theory Embodied cognition Free energy disambiguation, Optimal control Practopoiesis Predictive coding Self-organization Synergetics Variational Bayesian methods <laughs>